Hey there everyone, it's Hillary of Creative Faith and today I have a brand new YouTube video for you guys doing a flip through of the first 50 of 100 days of Less Hustle, More Jesus. This is a devotion book that uh, Sean Noel of Illustrated Faith wrote and Dayspring, you can get it there. I will link it, I think I have the link on Amazon that I'll put below if you guys wanna join, it's never too late. And I, this is my first ever 100 days book that I have gone through. There are three of them that have been created. And I have a video where I showed my setup that I will link down below. So this is pages one through 50, days 100 through 50. So we're halfway through the book, which is exciting and bittersweet all at once. <laughs> so I took mine to uh, Office Depot and got it coil bound, which I have loved. And then I also added this cute little charm that I got. So I just think that made it look kind of fun. And the little lobster claw is perfect. So I'll just kind of push it out of the way. And I'm not going to show you guys the first page yet. Um, but this is how I started it. I have June 1st to whenever it finishes. Whenever I'm done finishing it. <laughs> and so I'll just do a flip through. And I wanted to let you guys know that the Creative Faith shop right now is a part of a massive sale. There are 17 awesome shops collaborating together on a sale. And if you use the code CGOF sale, in the Creative Faith shop, you'll get 30% off all of your purchases. So when I'm referencing different kits, I'll link them down below so you guys can check them out and get them on sale. I also have things in here from Print Price Slay, from Ally Scraps, from Sweet and Sassy Stamps. I think that's it. Um, and they are also participating in the sale, so be sure to take advantage of that, and I'll try and link all the codes down below. So this is day one. I have been using a kit for my shop called Take It Slow. It's all about sloths, and so there's a lot of sloths throughout this. Less hustle to me, I think of sloths. And so um, that is one kit that you'll see a lot, which I'll link down below. I also use my printable prayer phrases, which is one of my favorite sets that I use a ton. And this is a stamp from Sweet and Sassy Stamps. It's called the Rebecca Script Alpha. And I use this a ton in this book. So I will link this down below from Sweet and Sassy Stamps. And so just thinking about home to your heart. And every single devotion I have less blank, more blank, or more blank, less blank. So that was a theme that I wanted to carry through my whole kit our whole devotion book. Um, here we have Take Care of You, day two. I use some stickers. This is from By the Well for God, this sloth stamp set that you'll see featured here a lot. And then this is a, an alphabet, also from Sweet and Sassy Stamps. Um, that's typewriter blocks, and I like that, and I love that one. And then these are some Maggie Holmes stickers. Day three, I used stickers and just kind of wanted to keep it really simple. This is my set called Seasons of Prayer Spring. And so I just wanted to keep it kind of black and white and have less fear, more courage really stand out. This page, I added a shimmery watercolor background. Again, less more using the Rebecca Script Alpha and a printable from Seasons of Prayer Spring. This one, I had really wanted to participate in this uh, devotion project. One of the reasons, because less hustle is just a theme that God has been putting in my life lately. And, well, kind of for the past three years. But I also have tons of beautiful die cuts and things that, like here's a big tub of them, that I use, but I have a lot of them. And I wanted to also kind of have this project to be a stash buster. This set from my shop is called Embrace Love, and I have a lot of elements on this page from it. And if you go over to my Instagram, which is Create a Faith Co., I have a hashtag, and I'll put the hashtag on the screen here. And if you look up that hashtag, you'll see all of the entries that I posted on Instagram and kind of what God's taught me about, about each of those. And here's a set from my shop, Season of the Prayer Summer. And some more awesome die cuts. Thinking about a beautiful journey we're on with Jesus. 
I also am using a lot of these Beloved Society printables, trying to sprinkle those throughout also. Um, Dare to Downshift, this is the first one I did um, back in May, so before it kind of officially started, and I just love that one. Known and Loved, so I'm using a lot of stamps throughout this devotion, a lot of little sloth stickers, sloth sticky notes, <laughs> and there's that alphabet again, the typewriter alpha, and then Heavenly Father and Amen Amen are from my printable prayer phrases set. I loved this one. I had this really pretty chandelier stamp, and I'm using one of Ally Scraps prayer request cards. I think this is from the Road Trip Time printables um, from Ally. That's one of my favorite ones that I use often. And this one, I have another Beloved Society girl, and I'm using two different stamp sets. This one's from Illustrated Faith, and then this one's from Growing Meadows. Surrender is my word for the year, so I think it's cool when God puts that word in my path while I'm reading devotions. Some more watercolor. I also am using a ton of washi tape. Oh, I love how this page came together. This is a really awesome message for me. Um, with God, all things are possible. Let every horizon remind you of this. Where you see limits, he sees possibility. Has it been kind of stressed about like um, money and finances and my future? So this page was another time where God just really spoke sweet words to my heart. And I'm using a set from my shop called Oh Happy Day. That I'll link below, and then this is another one of those prayer request cards from Ally Scraps. I loved this one, grateful for it all, reflecting on gratitude, and I used this all. Let's see if I have it next to my desk. Came from this set from Sweet and Sassy Stamps called All in All. And for the month of July, I am one of their guest designers, and I have a video where I talk all about that and show these stamps off that I'm using, and so I'll link that video down below if you guys want to check it out. So more printables and stamps. This one I used some of the March Planner Society kit elements, so I just thought that was really pretty. Uh, this is again from my Take It Slow Sloth kit. And I'm using this Illustrated Faith stamp a lot with the flowers. It's one of my favorite ones. Oh, and here, <laughs> my dear Martha, you are worried and upset over all these details. And I crossed off Martha and wrote Hillary. And so again, just trying to use some of these really pretty die cut sets that I have and little pieces, paper pieces. And this peony is one of my favorite things I've ever created. It's from my Seasons of Prayer Spring set. So I try and kind of have a color scheme for each of the days. And sometimes I try and match it to the print and art already on the page, and sometimes not. Love the little sloth sleeping. This page, I have a collaboration set with Kelly at Print Price Slay um, called Monstrous Envy, and I'll link my kit and her kit down below. And so this Avoid Envy came from her set, as well as this little element. And then this comparison is the Thief of Joy and this little green card and verse and don't let jealousy turn you into a monster all came from my set so this is another one of my favorite pages last fear 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 <laughs> this has been a really fun project for me to work through and just every time i open it see what god wants to teach me this is a freebie that you guys can get on my blog. I'll link it down below. It's called Endures Forever. My friend Josie of Gospel Confetti 
I'll link her Instagram down below, drew the artwork for it. And so it matches with a uh, devotion that I wrote. Again, it's a total freebie on the blog. But I matched with this theme of letting good thoughts grow. This page I haven't finished yet. I have the sticker from Heart by Cece and I'll link her shop down below but I want to do some sort of like random act of kindness thing <laughs> and I haven't gotten around to doing it yet so this page is not done yet and that's okay. <laughs> so again kind of having a cohesive color scheme. I love the background of how this turned out. I just basically layered a ton of washi tape on top of one another and then I used a grid index card that I cut down with this sloth sticky note. I love how this turned out. I used some of my very favorite washi tape. It's a fun one using some hot pink colors. Again using the all in all stamp set from Sweet and Sassy Stamps. I surrender all. And this is another one of my favorite pages. And I have the sloth from the Take It Slow set and then a couple of my printable prayer phrases. And, and then I use some stamps thinking about how God holds every season and we need to cling to him through wild prayer and surrender. Oh, here I have, these are the printable prayer phrases. They come in blue, pink, and black, all in one set. Having the hot air balloons remind me that God's ways are higher, get it, <laughs> than ours. This is one of my all-time favorite spreads that I did. So this is all about junk-free living and thinking about how, like, what are we thinking on? Are we focusing on gossip or um, scrolling on our cell phones or are we thinking on lovely things of the Lord and so I used a junk mail envelope I cut it down washi taped it on the side and adhered it in and then this is an old what do you call these flashcard and I used my seasons of prayer spring set for here and here and here and um, because I just love flowers and what a beautiful reminder of us to think on lovely things give ourselves grace. I also am using a ton of alphabet stickers, some more die cuts, some fun stamp sets, and I love, this is about um, I love you to the moon and back, and so I use these really fun alf alphabet stickers for more and less. This page, this was so cool how this worked out. So this stamp set is called Fill Me Up from Sweet and Sassy Stamps. And I'll link this down below. And if you use the CGOF sale code, you'll get 15% off. I think it is from Sweet and Sassy Stamps. Um, but I feel like the stamp set was like totally made for this page. It's all about how we need to refresh ourselves in the Lord and how we can't pour from an empty cup. And so I used the cup image and stamped it on pattern paper and the little coffee sleeve. Refresh, peace, love, Jesus and fill my cup. So I just loved how perfectly those two went together. And then thinking about laying down our burdens at the feet of Jesus. More contentment less and gratitude, less complaining and stressing about the future. And then, oh, I have one more. Um, these little mountains come from a new set from Sweet and Sassy called Walk by Faith. And I just think they look so cute down at the bottom because it's all about how we are like a volcano <laughs> about to erupt. And then I have, again, one of Allie's prayer request cards. Um, I think this one might be from the Love Well set. And I will link that down below. So I said this is a flip through of days 1 through 50, but I wanted to show you guys I'm not done with pages 49 or 50, and you also saw I'm not done with page 33. Um, so this is my little chart. This is my bullet journaling printable in my Etsy shop, and I'll link it down below, but I'm using it to track going through the 100 days. So I still need to do 3, 19, and 20, but 33, 49, and 50. 
And I wanted to just encourage you guys that it's okay if you're behind because God is going to use this devotion book and these devotions each day to speak to you where you're at. And so don't be discouraged if you're behind in the project or in any other projects because God knows what he's doing and when you need to hear um, the words and read the verses. So I wanted to leave you all with that. And I hope you like this flip through. Be sure to give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button and the bell notification so you guys don't miss out on any creative faith videos and also be sure to check out all the links down below shop the awesome sale happening on my in my etsy store as well as those other stores that i mentioned and i love you all so much thank you for supporting creative faith and i'll see you in the next video bye